Hello, I'm Chanel and I'm from Studio 67 and I'm here with Well.ca on set showing you tips and tricks of busy morning hairstyles. So we are here with Caroline today um, and we are going to show you how to do some quick and easy flat iron waves um, as well as a really nice simple updo um, to take you through your morning. Uh, to start, I would prep with a mousse. Um, we also have hairspray on hand, of course, a paddle brush, your flat iron, one comb, and I would go with three clips if you have them. Um, so it's really nice and simple. When you start, you're going to section the hair to go along the hairline so that it actually follows the hairline. With your flat iron, you put it up against the head, turn once, turn the hair once, and pull straight. And this gives it kind of a ribbon effect. So it pulls out straight, and you get your flat iron curl. Everything with the flat iron, you want to be pulling away from the face. So that the curl then curls away from the face. Now, a nice little trick for the longest hold is after you've pulled the iron through and you curl the curl back around, just hold it nice and tight when you spray with the hairspray. Allow it to cool there for a minute and that will hold the wave a lot longer. The flat iron wave is very forgiving, so you can go back through for instance, and we curl some of the areas. That being said, <laughs> I do think that it takes, it takes some time to get used to manipulating the hair with a flat iron, so don't be discouraged if you don't get it on the first go. This is finished product. We're going to give it just a couple minutes here on the side to let that cool. I would say five to ten even for the full head, and then you can brush through it. So because we prepped this out already. Just on the side here. Do it. You see we have some nice soft waves in the side here that are perfect for getting off to work. So mm -hmm. let's see here. I'm give those a couple of minutes. And there we have it, your flat iron wave. Okay, so now we're going to look at the half up, half down bun. Something really nice and easy and soft for work day um, or going out on the weekend. Not necessarily an updo for, say, um, a formal occasion. Um, but we are going to start with our hairspray. We have a brush and a comb and an elastic. So with a comb, <laughs> um, I like to section just at eyebrow height. Meet in the back. And just like a regular top bun, you're going to twist until you wrap it all the way around. You want it to kind of be a little bit messy, this bun. Gives it more of a bohemian look. Maybe even mess up some of these curls here. Top on. So we are here today with Stephanie and we are doing a quick roller set um, that we will then use to do a medium length updo. Um, so I have already prepped the roller set in a bricklay fashion in the back around the hairline 
we want to bring your rollers facing backwards so that they sit going away from the face. Everything coming back away from the face is going to actually create a lot of height, especially at the crown. The size of the roller that you put in is going to determine the size of the wave that you're going to get at the end. So I like to do a little bit smaller rollers around the hairline so that it's a little tighter wave. And then up around the crown to get a little looser so you get a little bit more of that body foot. So roller sets are really nice and easy because you, as soon as you finish putting them in, you can start taking them out. The one thing about roller sets is letting them cool before actually removing them. It'll give you the strongest wave. This is the kind of wave you're getting with your roller set. All right, now from here, creating like a nice soft updo. I'm actually gonna put it into a lower bun, but I want everything in here to be nice and soft and kind of PC. In which case I put my fingers in while spraying so that it keeps that PCness in here. You really is just playing with the pieces. We put it back in a nice little bun. It's a bit of a messy bun. Ooh, so maybe you can just consider it a bend. I'm gonna get you to just turn right around here. But very nice and elegant. Just to the side as well. So the side, perfect. Awesome. Okay, so just talking a little bit about the um, volumized ponytail. So anybody with fine textured hair, we have put um, her hair back again using a roller set, put it back in a ponytail, and we're just gonna actually back comb from the bottom in just to create a little bit more volume. Voilà, il y a un peu de temps.